I love myself, therefore I behave and I think in a loving way to all people. For I know that which I give out comes back to me multiplied. I release the need to be critical of myself when I make mistakes because I know I'm not a mistake and that I am learning. I know that I attract loving people into my world for they are a mirror of what I am. I love myself, therefore I forgive myself for everything. I forgive myself for my mistakes. I forgive and totally release the past and past experiences. And I now know I am free. I love myself, therefore I love totally in the now. I live in the now, I release the past, and I forgive myself and everyone. I love myself totally in the now, and I'm willing to experience each moment as good, and knowing that my future is bright, and all is well, my future is secure and joyous, because I am a beloved child of the universe. I am one with the universe. And this spirit, this universal love, takes care of me now and forevermore. And so it is. Say you grew up in a family where there was chaos and there might have been some abuse and neglect. You know, all of us live in this teaching in a new moment. We're capable of being in a new moment. You know, and we can release the need to be in any of those places because we're not the things our family did. Each of us are individualizations of God life and we have power to create a really wonderful life. And the next wonderful lyric was, I am not the voices in my head. And I laughed when I heard that because over the past 30 years, I've hear, heard people talk about what they call the committee. So you're living your life and everything, you're trying to do the best you can. And there seems to be this chatter in your head, which is like there, which will say, oh, you're messed up, you screwed up, you're a mess. You're never gonna succeed, this can't work, you're not working, you're not good enough. And that song, that lyric is, I'm not the voices in my head. See, the thing about this teaching is you're really learning to love yourself. And part and parcel of learning to love yourself is just letting go of all that stuff which people call the committee, or the old days they call it the council of the wicked. Of course, you know, we don't believe that there's any other power, any power for evil or anything like that. But we certainly have all this stuff in our head. So India Ari says, I'm not the voices <laughs> that are in my head. That stuff is nonsense. And you know, as you stay in this teaching, we're gonna teach you how to handle that nonsense. And you will theatrically say, I release the need for this. Any of that stuff that says you're anything less than wonderful, it's gotta go because you are light. You are the light of the light. You are one with the one.